as you can see, I got the GoPro today, and I'm actually filming this on there. Pretty, pretty sweet. Um, I put it on my helmet there, and oh, excuse me, I rode a little bit. Just um, I was gonna try and show the track and hit a few jumps and um, just something to upload, but the memory card filled up really fast. Um, it had some stuff on it that I didn't know about, so it filled up all the way, and the battery may or may not have died. I'm not sure, but um. So I'm recording it now, and it's dark outside now, as you can see, um, so I can't ride. But I'll be riding tomorrow. Um, this was just a quick update in case you follow me on Twitter and you saw that I got the GoPro. Um, yeah, it came today, but I wasn't able to get any actual riding footage. Um, in a second, I'll show the clip that I did get. It did record for two and a half minutes, but it was while my bike was warming up and stuff, so it's just me sitting there. But um, if you yourself have a GoPro and you have any tips of setting it up or um, which mode it's in. I'm in the mode number three. Um, if you have the Hero 1, maybe you'll know what that means. Um, I don't know. It's, it's 720 at 60 frames per second, I think. Something like that. But um, let me know what you run yours in. Um, if you have any tips of, I don't know, I already put it on my helmet, so I'm not going to move it. It seemed to look good, but um, tell me if you think I should maybe angle it down more, angle it up more. Even though you can't see me riding, you can see me sitting on the bike. So, um, Look out for more. I'm really excited to have this and to use it and hopefully get some cool stuff. Let you guys see my track from uh, my perspective as I ride it and hopefully hit up the local track and ride out there. So until next time, guys, take it easy. If it's easy, take it twice. I'll talk to you later.